Now, if you were at least a, a little bit smart, you would have known before <laughs> that YouTube was going to pull that video. I mean. Yeah, well, look, jackass, as I, you know, you don't watch my videos, obviously, and then you decide that you have a right to comment on what I know or my intelligence. It's kind of silly. I mean, I've pointed it out in two or three videos now that I previewed what was on YouTube before I made my video. I checked to make sure the content existed, you know, the same content so that it, it wasn't something that would get removed because there was already content that had received hundreds of thousands of views that was no better, uh, that was no less offensive. And it wasn't even marked adult, none of it. So, I mean, um, how, how, am, how am I lacking intelligence because I did the research first, verified that it wasn't a violation of the terms of service, and then made the video? You, on the other hand, don't watch the, the videos and feel you have a, uh, the, the capacity to comment on them. Uh, I mean, who's the fucktard in that scenario? You know how many people are watching you just for the lulls? <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty sure that there's even Encyclopedia Dramatica um, subscribed to you just so that they can keep tabs on you. And they don't comment because... Yeah, well, whatever. Uh, you know, so life's a popularity contest? Is that all it's about? I mean, the fact that I'm, um, you know, disliked by the majority of imbeciles on planet Earth wouldn't surprise me, asshole. Um, and the fact that some people get it is just a fact, okay? I mean, I can send you the PMs if you want to read them. Um, so, yeah, if I'm only talking to 25 rational people, well, that's 25 rational people I wasn't talking to five years ago. It's not right, but... You can't help it, you know, you gotta see it because there's still that sense of pleasure in seeing some some fucking crazy nut jib. Um <laughs> nut jib. <laughs> nut jib. I thought that was like on a boat. Isn't that like a some kind of nut you tie on the jib? <laughs> the nut jib. <laughs> well anyway. Um yeah, well that's kind of a cheap shot, but uh, you know, you ask for it sort of. You ask for cheap shots because that's all you you throw. Um but anyway, um <laughs> you know, look, 90% of my videos are kind of stale philosophy. Really, 90%, I think. I mean, the number's pretty high anyway. 85%, whatever. It's a pretty high fucking number where the video is just me talking about how your motherfucking brain works. <laughs> it's kind of funny. I'm talking brain science, and you apparently don't find that 90% of the videos interesting, even though you're supposed to be a brain scientist. We are all the bad guys, and we are tainting your image. <laughs> Yeah, well, you know, yeah, if there's a bunch of retards in your front yard, it's going to make you, you know, some of that retardedness is going to rub off on your image. Um, you know, sure. Um, yeah, let's not, I won't go into the damages you fucktards cost, because we can do that in court. Um, but regardless, it's just, it's petty, stupid, and irresponsible rhetoric. That's the bottom line. Irresponsible rhetoric. If you can find yourself to reasonable insults, you know, that fall within the legal limits, then I wouldn't have an argument. But you can't do that. You're so desperate. You have to throw, you have to put rocks in your mud ball. You're just a little desperate, petty asshole that shoves rocks in the snowball, you know, that just can't, can't play the game fair. So you have to fuck with things. And you're fucking with the law. And it's just, you talk about stupid, it's just plain stupid. And we're making you look bad <laughs> on YouTube. <laughs> you post a video where you're dancing naked like some kind of fucking lunatic. Yeah, like a Academy Award winning movie lunatic. I mean, you know, it's a parody asshole. Um, you know, whatever. And even this, the word naked is a little bit useless if you're... If you're using it uh, generically, um, you know, to describe any kind of uh, unclothed appearance. I mean, you know, realistically, naked is for a man. You know, we know, we know where the naked parts are. I mean, the the the, the ones important to that concept of nakedness. Um, <laughs> you know, we just gotta present that to a judge and say, you know, this is a guy that's saying that we are tainting his image, okay, on YouTube. And, uh, there's gotta be enough for the judge to say, you know, <laughs> you're just 
You're just a crazy person. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, that's a that's a really high standard you you apply, and so I, I'm just sort of insulting the judge's intelligence. It's kind of like saying to the judge, you know, if I put a bone in my nose that said "fuck you" or something, that somehow that would mean any argument I presented to that judge would be destroyed because the judge couldn't see anything but that. Uh, so you're just basically insulting the judge's intelligence. There'll be an argument to made whether or not. Um, um, well, whatever. You know, like I said, one doesn't really have anything to do with the other. Uh, one is a parody. One is my life. Fucker. I swear to God, I saw it, and I was just appalled by it. I was... He actually put a camera in front of him and started dancing naked. It's like, okay, what the fuck is wrong with this guy? There's got to be something wrong with this guy. Right. And if you admit you've seen the movie... And, and so you're still gonna you're gonna you're still gonna say that your commentary makes any sense whatsoever that it shocked you that it uh, you know you got some sort of hysterical reaction I mean I'm glad if I can cause that the realization that you knew it was gonna be pulled you knew that YouTube was gonna take it down because I mean it breaks the TOS just absolutely and so why don't the other videos break the TOS? You know, you don't watch the videos, of course, you don't, I guess, you, and you weren't clever enough, you know, didn't have enough brain science intuition to do a search yourself. Um, but, you know, there's plenty of video out there of, of the same imagery um, in high definition even, you know, higher resolution. Um, you know, it's got hundreds of thousands of views, it's not marked adult. So how, how do you explain that uh, contradiction you know even though YouTube can ignore certain things if there's one thing they never ignore is pornography and you seem to think that pornography might only um, be with beautiful women but it also is pornography oh please <laughs> you know no one pornography well, well let's let's not even let's not even go there we should all know what the definition of pornography is and the key component of of pornography was tucked in the particular video so there's no way it could be pornography um just you know it's a silly it's you know it's just it's, it's just a silly definition that that you should be I mean, I'm, whatever, I, you know, the fact that you have any credibility, that you aren't getting, you know, 100 comments saying, what are you, fucking out of your mind, defining pornography this way? Are you out of your, you, you got to be insane, right? Um, there's got to be a voice in your head saying you're full of shit when you call that video pornography. Saggy, disgusting old man get naked in front of a camera. <laughs> Yeah, well, like I said, I didn't get entirely naked, but regardless, uh, you know, I'll put my saggy, flabby old man body against your flabby young man Bobby body any time. So you want to have that competition, I'll kick your fucking ass. <laughs> just because, just because you're disgusting, <laughs> it doesn't mean there's going to be art in some way. It's still pornography, just disgusting pornography, but it's still pornography altogether. So, uh, in Mendham, please stop playing the victim here. You're not a victim. You're just a crazy uh, guy that has absolutely nothing to do with, his, with all his free time. So, good God almighty. Damn, I don't even know what to say to someone like you, because it's like, you know they're not they're not even going to understand what you're coming from because you're just so cuckoo in the head that so yeah yeah more scientific jargon cuckoo in the head <laughs> yeah uh yeah right i'm not going to understand i'm not going to understand your highly technical definitions of things like cuckoo in the head and pornography yeah only yes only an imbecile could understand what the fuck you were saying in this video because you were just so entirely full of shit. I mean, every premise was wrong, and every conclusion was crap. And the laughter was a soundtrack. Yeah, you might say that I'm slandering you again and shit, but, you know, since apparently your uh, lawsuit is going nowhere, then what can I tell you?
Yeah. Yeah, right. Well, why don't you tell everybody the truth for a change? That would be a novel thing. The novel approach for you is to quit contriving a personality and actually try to be a human being. An honest one. <laughs> See? See, if you do it in the backward way, you can get away with it. But if you come out and flatly say certain words, it's, it's just troublesome. Um, that's just the facts. That's just the way the law works, asshole. And the lawsuit will do what it, the lawsuit's going to do. Take some time. That's the way the process works. Take some time. Um, so anyway, fuck you. Whatever. Uh, maybe next time you won't fail as catastrophically as you did in this video.